Welcome to the first ever episode of Today I Learned with Billy. Today, we're going to be learning about how to take a Neutrik NC4 FRX connector apart. Uh, this is, video is intended to show how you take this connector completely apart if, it, if this part is snapped in and assembled. So, first thing we're going to want to do is we're going to take this boot part off, which just unspins, or just spins from here, that over there. It has a top part that's this back piece. This part comes off just like that. And set that over there. Now, when, the reason you have all come here is you want to know how to take this center part out. Because this is where the pins are connected. And it's this guy right here. So what you're going to do is you want to take, you want to take this and spin this completely around. You show this. You're going to press this pin in until this is completely upside down looks just like that. On the bottom here, there is a little spring clip that holds this in. Adjust this so that you can see it. There's a little spring clip, and all you have to do is put it down on the table just like this, and I'm using this pair of tweezers, and just pop the spring clip, and it'll come right out just like that. You remove the spring clip, put that down, Take the blunt object of your choice. We're gonna again use this pair of tweezers and we're just gonna push this guy right out. And now the blunt object of our choice is gonna be our finger. But then we're gonna have to spin this around again. And then we'll stick the tweezers back in. Boop, and there you go. And that's how you take apart a Neutrik NC4 FRX right angled connector. Uh, this is a four pin connector. I assume it works with all of the Neutrik family of right angled connectors, so it's up to you. Good luck.